Self-awareness is a superpower. My name is Kathy LaDonna. Welcome to Soul and Vibration. So I would love to be <laughs> alive because every time I talk about Leo energy, like I always start smiling because I just love Leo energy and it's no bias, not because my moon is there, but it's like something about the way how this energy makes me feel like it always makes me laugh. So it's like, yes, I would love to be married to a Leo person because this is a relationship where I get to be forever young. Like we are two kids. Like this is a situation where you know, you're constantly laughing together. You're constantly playing together because the Leo loves to laugh. The Leo is super playful. The Leo is cuddly. The Leo is fun. The Leo has a big heart. The Leo is affectionate, you know? So it's like, imagine being in a situation that is so warm, cuddly, but at the same time, spicy and fiery because the Leo has its moments when it can be super spicy and fiery in the sense that, some Leos could be so dramatic and I've experienced this personally where like you guys might have a disagreement and they'll want to put on a show and have a fight in front of other people. I don't mean a real fight where you guys are just tearing each other apart, but like, you know, bicker back and forth in front of other people and then make up in front of other people again. And of course, my Scorpio son, Virgo Ascendant, is not having it. Like, you are, Jamaicans have this saying, Papi Shua, like, you're not gonna make a clown out of me in front of all these people. Like, we're not gonna fight and make up in front of nobody. Like, my Scorpio energy wants all this to happen behind closed doors. Like, I'll talk to you when we get home. Until then, like, I ain't got nothing to say. But like, being married to a Leo is just, to me, it's just super exciting, super fun, super playful. A situation where it's like, you know, I like art, I like fashion, I like beauty. And Leo loves to put themselves together. They like to look nice, smell nice. So it's like the Leo is going to appreciate you putting yourself together. The Leo is going to appreciate you looking nice. Like the Leo is going to encourage you to look nice because they themselves is going to want to look nice beside you. And if you're someone who likes to put yourself together and keep yourself up, like your Leo is going to take pride in wanting to show you off. And, you know, I think that's super cute. And another thing too with Leo, again, is the drama. Like Leo could be so dramatic and I think it's funny especially when you're in a committed relationship, a marriage, we're talking about marriage here. So, you know, you're in a marriage, you know, you guys know that this is death do us part. Like it's not toxic where anybody's abusing anybody or whatever. So nobody's going anywhere. So in a situation like that is like the drama comes in where it's like the back and forth, like, how would I put it? Like, let me put it this way. Like Leo energy is a kind of energy that enjoys like makeup sex, making up after the drama. Like that's even ex more exciting. So it's like, as long as you are not like shaming your Leo, like, so with Leo, sometimes you have to know it's a thin line in the sense that, how would I put it? Like basically with the Leo, you could say things to a Leo that could be it's weird because it's like, say you could be playful in a way that's childish and a little bit mean, but it's like, you can't cross the line to where it's like you, you affect the Leo's pride. So it's almost like you got to know what you're doing with your Leo when things get feisty and you guys start bickering back and forth, back and forth. It's like, it's like know where the line is because Leo is interesting where if you ever like cross the line and you offend the Leo, you affect their pride. It's like there might be no getting back. But of course, you're married till death, you part. So it's like, yeah, you guys will be together. But for a while, it's like like a cat with their tail between their legs. They go off and disappear for a while. 
your Leo might ignore you for a while until they get over whatever it is that you said that caused that affected their pride. But like, let's get the pride stuff out the way, minus all the pride stuff. Like this is a relationship where you're with someone who is constantly proud. Like I love seeing dom strong Leo energy in people because especially a, in a person who basically is is confident within themselves, not fake confidence. Cause like I can tell fake confidence. To me, genuine confidence is when a person just knows that everything is gonna be all right, no matter what. So they just allow themselves to just be because it's like, it's like, fuck it. Like who cares about what, I mean, we care about what happens, but you know, either way it's gonna be all right. And a person with that vibe is just so, you know who has strong Leo energy? Idris Elba, like he has strong Leo energy and I think he's so attractive. Not just his look, his whole vibe. So in male or female, like when they have that strong Leo energy, it is just so swagged up. It is so, it is such a turn on like, you know, like imagine like looking at a safari video and the lion is just walking. It's like the way the lion moves, like the way the lion moves his body is like it takes up the right amount of space. It doesn't hold itself together. It, it just it's just so free. And that's so attractive to me to see like Leo energy within this element element and confident within itself it is just so powerful and it just oozes all this sexiness so it's like yeah being married to a leo is a situation that is creative it's playful it's like and and not even just that it's like it's expressive it's just super vibrant this is a very vibrant connection a very heartfelt vibrant connection to me being in a relationship with this person and you guys are one you know, it's like, it's, it's almost like you have your partner in crime. It's like, basically you guys are two performers or whatever, like say destiny child is coming to mind, but it's just two of you in the group or any group or whatever. And it's like every day when you guys step out the house together, you step out to shine because the Leo takes pride in shining and whoever that the Leo is with needs to shine too. So best believe that you need to keep yourself together, male or female. Like the Leo will tell you like, hey, you should get your nails done or you need to go get a lineup. You need to go clean your beard up. You need some new clothes. You know what I mean? Because it's like you are a part of the Leo's pride. You know what I mean? And the Leo takes pride in its pride just as much as it takes pride in itself. So it's like, you guys are a beautiful union. Like I mentioned, it's like a, a duet, like a, like a band of two where it's like, you know, like y'all go out, y'all stand out and everybody like, and, and, and people stare because it's like, one thing with Leo energy that makes people stare is the confidence that the Leo exudes. That confidence is very attractive. It doesn't matter how tall a person is, how short, how skinny, how attractive, how unattractive. When a person is genuinely confident within themselves and they don't give a fuck about what anyone has to say, think, or anything like that, that shit is so sexy and it just it pulls everybody in that it, it just it's like the sun it pulls everything into its orbit and you have to look twice and you want to have an experience of that it's like you want to experience them because it's like what do they know that we don't know like what are i want to be a part of that world i what are what am i missing that's happening in their world like i don't know but it's just super attractive so yeah i would love to marry leo energy a leo because i know that there'll never be a dull moment that's my partner in crime like we step out we laugh together we play together we have fun together but most importantly we look good together you know so yeah that's why i would marry leo energy if you guys are still here with me i would love to hear about it please let me know by dropping me a blue heart in the comment box below i would love to hear from you love yourself as if your life depended on it because it does take care of yourself and i look forward to seeing you in the next video